I got to work with the new video game pick up video. So I need the video games and other related things I picked up. Got an office if you and just go through the movies really quickly. So let's jump into it. Let's get those out of the way because I have some of those too. But what I got me this the Koopa Chronicles DVD. Had some of the old Super Mario Brothers show, Super Mario, the events of the Super Mario Bros. 3 and Super Mario Award show. So Mario DVD. Happy to get that. I got that for me, which is cool. I just recently got this, the Cyborg 009 uh, Unrated and Uncut. This contains the first two dicks for the series, so it's cool. That's cool to get a uh, version that has the first two, basically kind of like volumes could use it. You can get them where you get like four episodes on the thing, so that contains like the first two. That was awesome. Uh, that was really awesome, yeah. One of my favorite movies of all time. Kingsman, The Secret Service. I don't know, it's like one of my favorite movies, so definitely. Something I wanted to have a physical copy of, and I thought it was a cheaper target, so I picked it up. Uh, next, we're gonna move to Marvel stuff. We got a few things here I picked up. I picked up Ultimate Avengers number two. I have not really seen this one, so I'm excited to give that one a watch. They have to watch that. I've not seen that one really, so that's cool. Uh, movies I have seen, but I haven't seen in a while, is the Incredible Hulk movie, one of the first movies that's part of the Marvel Cinematic Universe. So that's pretty cool. We're definitely gonna give that a rewatch at some point. Another movie I need to be watched is Punisher Warzone. I think it's an okay Punisher movie. Not bad. Uh, complete. Got that. It's pretty cool. And then for DC, we only have two. I found Justice League Crisis on two watch. Did watch this one already. Uh, complete. Awesome. I really enjoyed that. Another DC anime movie I did not have. And another movie I got was Wonder Woman, the commemorative edition. Uh, I think this is just a newer version of the old animated. A Wonder Woman animated movie, so I'm just gonna wait for this. I'm gonna just replace it with mine, so that's pretty cool. That uh, last two movies we have are pretty cool. Uh, the Venom show something. Uh, we got this from my Alchemist. This is season one, part two. This is the first season. Uh, it's put up in the parts. I have part one. Uh, this is part two. Also, upstairs, I have parts. I also got part season two, part one and two. I got all of season two as well. I don't have them down here, but I did get those as well. It was like eight bucks a piece. They come with like these dicks with all the rage dicks in them, and then we have this. Pretty awesome to get those. Pretty awesome to get those. And probably my favorite movie I got out of all this in a while was this, the first ish movie of Wu Kenshin Part One Origins. Uh, we have slip cover on it. It is a Blu-ray, but it comes with like a regular version, as you can see, and a Blu-ray. So you get both versions. That's kind of cool. And it gets like, a digital download. It's actually a pretty cool adaptation of the show, um, of the show slash manga. It's actually did pretty decently. I enjoy it, and I know there's part two and three I want to get at some point, so that's going to be awesome to get those. Now we're going to move on to the actual games. We have some games over here. I'm moving them closer so I can get to them. I have to play this in one game because I only have two. I found this NBA Live 2002. This is a PlayStation. It says Collector's Edition. It was like one to two bucks, so it's like I'm not going to... It was like a buck or two, so I picked it up and have it. So that was nice. We're gonna sit back there. That place in one game I picked up, it's kinda cool. A uh, Tiny Toons Adventures, Bugsy's, Plexi's Big Adventure. A uh, nice and complete game. Tiny Toons Adventures is awesome. Hey, with Santa Maniac, so that was pretty cool to get. Uh, we'll save that from Flash, because it's kinda like the coolest one. We'll go through some of these PlayStation 2 games, because they got a bunch of them here. And we got a bunch of PlayStation 2 games. Uh, both of these I was really happy with. I got actually a deck of PlayStation 2 games here. A couple of them uh, may be questionable on how good they are, but you gotta show them anyway. Oh, we got The Sims. This is a PlayStation 2. That's the game in it. I'm not gonna complain. Didn't have it, so I got it for a couple bucks. Also got Grand Turismo 3 A Space. That's a great assist version, but I actually do like the great assist version. I have a punch from them. I don't mind it being great assist. Another awesome game. Other game we got was. Dance Dance Revolution, Dance Dance, Revol Dance, Dance Revolution Scream 2 for PlayStation 2, and this is complete, has everything in it. This also came with a thing, like a pad. I'm gonna show you that right now. So, talking a little bit over this, I did come with the pad. It's like two to three bucks. It was so cheap enough I had to get it. I didn't have the game, so the game alone for that. So, I was like, gotta pick it up. Now we're getting on to the game, so I think it's somewhat decent. Oh, we have Power Rangers Dark Thunder. I don't know if this is decent, if this is a good game or not, but I like Power Rangers, so I'll be able to pick this up for like two bucks. I'm gonna pick it up. Awesome to get that for the collection. Uh, the game I've heard good things about Simpsons Road Rage. Another cool game complete. It's the greatest version, but I'm totally fine with. So 
awesome to get that. Another cool game. We've got IGPX. One also Grand Prix. This is based on anime. Um, yeah, this one. I don't know if this game's good, but this one looks like a definitely mold. Click on some more decent games. So I'm excited that that's in my collection. I actually do remember the show on Cartoon Network, so that's cool. The last two we have are Sweet Code and Free for PlayStation 2. Another game off the other people's stuff. A complete. And this is actually. I know it's a decent game, so I was like, I mean, it's like an RP it looks like an RPG type of game, so I mean, yeah, it's probably a game that's what's pretty cool for getting it for like only five bucks. And we have Dark Cloud for the PlayStation 2. This is a uh, great event as well, not gonna complain too much. It is complete, and it is pretty nice to get this game. I've seen this, this is a game I think I've heard, I think, good things about this game. I'm not sure. I feel like this is, this is one of the games I always think of using some good PlayStation 2 games. The games like this, Shadow Colossus, that just come to mind is one of them. But yeah, I'll definitely give this a try at some point. Don't know how I'm complete it, but definitely give it a try at some point. So yeah. And the last but not least is the one game I got. That I want to say the best last. I don't know if it's really the best, but for what it is, it's pretty cool. Mario's Time Machine Complete in Box. I'm gonna pull out the thing here. We're gonna open this bad boy. I'm gonna show you what's inside of this. And we have anything else. So we have the box here. It's actually in pretty nice shape. As you can see, there's some stuff with some sticker damage and stuff like that. Sticker residue. But other than that, it's a pretty nice box. It came with the manual, but it definitely has seen better days. Both of the pages are just wrinkled, nothing really. Uh, pages are just wrinkled, so it's all there. It's not torn or anything, so that's pretty cool. And then we got the game. We're still in this, like, thing. This. I'm uh, still in this packaging. What I'm checking to see if this can be opened. I'm checking right now. This might be a sealed game. No, it's not. It can be. It can be opened, so this could have been opened. But it also has this stuff leave on it. But specifically, if you can't tell, see, it has the Super Nintendo logo on it. So yeah, this is cool. I don't have any of these Super Nintendo duck leaves, so this is in really nice condition. I don't know if it came like this. Like if it, when these when a Super Nintendo game originally came out, like back in the day. I don't know if they came with these duck logos. I wouldn't be surprised if they came with these bags. But the duck sleeves are weird. I don't know. Like I said, my Super Nintendo launch. I know it came with the game, uh, the cartridge, this white thing. I don't know if it came with the um, thing to put over the game or the bag. I'm assuming they did, but I don't know. I'm gonna try and put this back in here if I can. I'll put that back in there and there was just throw the manual one on there. Not too big a deal. Uh, without trying to completely destroy it. So yeah, this is my brother got me this. He got it for me for, I think it was 25. What's well, not horrible for being complete box. I don't know how bad this game is. It's not the easiest of games. I think for completing box, 25 is definitely fair for this game. So yeah, I was happy to get that. So this is probably one of the coolest inbox. Probably my coolest inbox Super Nintendo game. Probably one of the cool. It's a game I don't know how to play. I'll definitely play it, give it a shot. I'm probably not really gonna cut and beat it, but yeah, that's really cool to get. It's probably one. Of, it's one of the games I wanted to get and to get a complete, complete other bargain. So that's it for the video. I'm gonna film another one that one more video game pickup video of the film. I don't know how I film it now, but it's gonna be going over strategy guys and all that stuff because we got a shit ton of strategy guys. So yeah. If you guys watching the video, you guys can always like, subscribe, all that fun stuff, and you can always stay up and I'll see you next video guys. Bye.